Do you want to know about some great authors that you can read and reread and reread? If yes, then keep watching this video. Hi guys, I'm Anpreet and today I'm going to list down my top authors that I want to read in 2017. Now these are not the authors that I have not read at all. These are mostly the authors that I have read before and I love their writing. I love the way they write books and I definitely wanted to talk about them with you guys and also it makes me accountable to read these authors even more because last year I kind of ignored them and that was the biggest mistake of my life. So that's why I'm making this video and I'm hoping it will help you out to pick some great authors. So without further ado, let's get started with this video. Author number one is Nicholas Sparks. Now he is the author of The Notebook, The Choice, True Believer and many many romantic novels and the way he writes romance. It's amazing. You know, the characters that are in this book and the way the plot is, the way the picturization is, all is so good that you won't be able to forget the books and even leave the books once you start reading them. I literally read The Choice in the toughest uh, situation where I was, uh, right, you know, I was taking a bus and I was feeling dizzy, but I just could not stop reading the book because he writes it so amazingly. And uh, to be truthful, I read a lot of romance, but till date, I haven't read any romantic novel that was better than Nicholas Sparks novels so yes author number two is obviously one of my favorite authors that is Paulo Coelho now last year I read one book by Paulo Coelho which was not that great but then I'm again reading a book by Paulo Coelho right now when I'm making this video he writes amazingly because you know his books are just not fiction as I always say that his books are a combination of fiction and philosophy and you can learn a lot through those books. So those of uh, you who want to read, you know, some self-help books but they just can't get themselves to read them, you should try to, you know, get your lessons via the books like these. And these are like always amazing, different kind of books that you should read. So yes, my number two author is Paulo Coelho. Now, I would not say that all the books by Paulo Coelho are great, but you know, the overall combination of his books is worth reading. So you should start with the Brida 11 minutes. And right now I'm reading The Witch of Portobello and the book was interesting and amazing since page one. So yeah, go ahead and read his books. Author number three is the one which I haven't read before, but she is most famous for writing contemporary novels, which are a blend of romance and all sort of those things. And that is the Sophie Kinsella. Now I have heard a lot about her and she writes very light hearted, good novels. That is what I have heard. So I'm very excited to read her books this year. I already have the Undomestic Goddess and the plot seems really nice. So yes, this is my author number three. The next author is the one which I have recommended even to the people who are not used to reading books or who hate reading books but they have loved her and that is the Camilla Lackberg who writes crime fiction novels. I have read The Ice Princess and I got one of the haters of reading <laughs> read the stone cutter and her books are amazing the mystery she builds around uh you know crime and the way she does it is super amazing just start with the ice princess and you would not regret your decision ever in your life next author is francis hodson bernard who writes children fiction novels and her novels are classics so i do i even need to say anything about it though i do not guess novels on the basis of whether they're classics or not but her books are truly amazing and very strong writing is there in her books that's it that's it for this author just read her and you'll know how she is the next author is the one who writes extremely emotional and heart-wrenching stories and that is the Khaled Husseini. Now he, I have read The Kite Runner by Khaled Husseini and I have always been willing to read A Thousand Splendid Sons and I have the book and I'll read it in this year. You should also try his books and read The Kite Runner first. The next author is The Gillian Flynn. I read The Gone Girl and you know I'm a fan of her. She writes amazing psychological thrillers and I kind of like that psychological stuff and Frodo just you know made everything fall off. <laughs> I, I have forgotten where was I but Gillian Flynn is an author you should definitely read. I have read that all of her books are equally amazing. They might not be as amazing as Gone Girl but first read Gone Girl and then go ahead with more of her books. Lastly, I have Ashwin Sanghi. Now, I read a non-fiction by Ashwin Sanghi, but I know that he writes amazing fiction books. He's one of the most popular Indian authors at present. And that's why I want to read some of his fiction. So if you guys can suggest me which is the book which I, I should start with, then let me know in the comments down below. That's it, guys. These are the authors that I want to read in 2017. And these are truly amazing authors. Either it's based on my experience or on my research. So you should also read these authors along with me. Thank you so much for watching this video. And if you did like it, 
make sure you hit thumbs up and comment down below with what you liked about it bye bye this is manvi signing off